welcome back to another video of Mika Sugar Box and in today's video I'll be doing a fun experiment with you which is the National Geographic Discovery Crystal Aquarium and I'm really excited to open this. I got this as a gift for Christmas from Santa so here hold on I have to close this. with uh, instructions looks like the instruction instructions and tips a fact booklet um, which I will read to you towards the end of the video some growing rocks and they grow up to two inches because it says I mean four inches because it says up here that rocks grow up to four inches then we have some glowing solution two bottles of glowing solution ah, i can't get this out here's the first bottle of glowing solution they're hard to get out and it's okay and this is the second bottle of glowing solution it also comes with a sticker pack, which I don't think I'm going to use, but because this has a lot of crystals already, and I have to take out that bucket. I'll it like this, and I'll try to. background and we need the four tapes to stick this on so let's stick it on you just have to place it upside down on this way like that then you can see it from the front side forward side then you will need your tape and your scissors to cut oh to cut the tape but I have already cut my tape so glue it on i mean tape it on not glue it on tape it over there towards the top the next part of the top oh there and the bottom so last left bottom left or right kind of and yeah let's just make this go over here stuck okay did I do it upside down yeah it was upside down how did I not know it was upside down oh well it makes more sense do that too this is taking too long but there oh I need to screw it and tape it not glue it Back on. You can see it. Glue it. This side. This. Okay. Hold on. There. Kind of went inside, but that's okay. Just like that. And then um, you read your instructions. So I'll see you after I read the instructions, open the rocks up, and yeah. So guys, I have um, put all my setup, and I have a sink over here just in case I need to wash my hand, um, a tissue paper, um, kitchen paper, and I have the rocks all crushed up, which you need to do. Um, before you start the experiment and uh, I have my scare, 
lipstick thingy. I got it from my art kit. That's why it's a little stained. Um, so let's get started. I'm going to tear this slowly. Um, please do this um, with an adult beside. I have my dad behind the camera um, just to supervise me. So you also keep your parents. I'm going to take out the big rocks. Put them in. I'll put this underneath. I'll get a purple one. orange yellow one and I have a green one left a green one maybe I'll add another one like that so I'm going to put two of each and it's kind of sticky but I need a green one. Now safely keep this somewhere. We're just putting the aluminum foil over there just to, um, if you want, you can reuse it and then do the experiment again with the rocks. Now I'm with, with the rocks, now I'm going to just wash my hands just a little bit. And yes, I did put on some gloves. And I have goggles just in case. Wash, I mean, wipe my hands. I have a whole bundle, but I just keep one underneath over there. Um, now we're going to take my skewer stick thingy and then just adjust them just so they're not touching. You can arrange them in any way. Maybe I can do a pattern. I'll put the yellow here. I'll do blue, green, yellow, and purple. Blue, green, how would you read? Blue, green, yellow, and purple. I'll look there. And then, now you have to bring back, oh my god, I'll just keep this here. Bring back the jar, then put in your glowing solution. Maybe I should put down my goggles. I can see it. Almost there. I think all of it got in. Look how it goes and how it goes. And then the second one. I think some spilled. I don't know. And then put the cap on. Oh, my glove. Oh. Oh, oh my, my glove went in. And then don't forget to wash your hands because my glove went in. Do that. No, turn it. Okay. I'm just reusing my paper towel because it's good for the environment. And then after we've used it two times, into the trash can. 
I have a trash can over there. Okay. So just put up my goggles. Don't touch your goggles because it's practically touching your face. Um, now you have to pour it in there. I mean, pour the mixture, then pour it in. I mean, this is just water, lukewarm water. It's 750 ml. Okay, now you have to stir it well. I'm going to put down my goggles again. Okay, I think that's enough. If you want, you can wash your stick, but I'm just going to leave it over here. Like that. Um, now you have to pour it in there. Ask a parent for help because if it spills, it's going to be a disaster. So I'm going to get my dad and I'll see you in a second. So guys, my dad helped me pour in the solution. Please do ask your mo mom and dad or your parents or any adults to help you um, because this is actual chemicals. So ask a parent for help. And yeah, so if you can see, there is a 10 minute, 30 minute, and 120 minute thingy. So I'll show you those, so yeah. They're almost starting to grow. Now I'm going to ask Alexa to set some timers for 10 minutes, 30 minutes, and 120 minutes. Alexa, set a timer for 10 minutes. 10 minutes, starting now. So guys, right now I'm going to pause the video and I'll show you some updates on it after the 10, 20 minutes, I mean 10 minutes pass. Okay, you guys heard her. It's been 10 minutes and now it's time to set a timer for 30 minutes. So let's ask her. Alexa, set a timer for 20 minutes. 20 minutes, starting now. We're putting a timer for 20 minutes because we just did 10 minutes and three minus two and you add the zero, it's 20. A lot of math. So guys, um, in the lead, there is green, and then second, I think it's pink, then blue. At first, blue was on top, but I guess not now. But yellow is like in fourth place, I think, like that yellow. I hope that green wins, because green is my favorite color, if you don't know already. So guys, um, time's up. And they have grown a lot, like it says on the package. So let's ask Alexa. Alexa, set a timer for 90 minutes. One hour and 30 minutes, starting now. Okay, so watch until 120 minutes are done.
So guys, as you can see, they are um, now grown to 120 minute and the looks like the winner is blue. Um, so yeah, now I'm going to read you the booklet I said in the beginning of the video. So guys, here I have my booklet and, oh, that was upside down. Oh well, um, now I have my booklet and the crystals are fully grown. So let's get reading. I have to open the booklet up. There. Crystal Aquarium. Timing crystals are timing crystals use electric currents which vibrate at specific rate. Quartz crystals are used in watches and other electronics. Fun fact: Do you use a computer? Many computer screens are actually made up of liquid liquidized crystals. That's cool. Did you know crystallography is the scientific study of crystals and how they form? And that's exactly what we're doing over here. The ch chili ahuan, that's, that's a long word and it's hard to pronounce. Um, the ch Chihuahua, Chihuahuan Desert in in Mexico is the home of some of the world's largest natural crystals ever found. Some are 36 feet long and weigh 55 tons. Oh my gosh, that is so cool. Snowflakes are ice crystals that form high in the clouds when water freezes. There are never identical snowflakes. I've heard that before. And there's a picture of a snowflake. A picture of a crystal and I'll show you the whole thing hopefully you can see the whole thing over here and yeah so. I hope you liked today's video and this is what I got for Christmas and go ahead if you haven't already watched my other video of christmas so yeah i hope you like this video give me a thumbs up if you did like it go ahead and click that subscribe button ring that notification bell ding ding bye